Hi, welcome. This is Happiness in Your Hormones, 12 weeks to happiness and harmony, and it all starts here. So congratulations, you're here on the beginning of the journey. And I wanna set the foundation because the foundation is really essential for you to achieve your goals. So I've got a worksheet and it's called Get It Done. And we're gonna add things over to the Get It Done and do them. And on this uh, handout worksheet, uh, there's seven main areas and I actually might add uh, an eighth one as well as a miscellaneous but there are seven main areas and just to go through them quickly with you now number one is diet I mean diet you are what you eat this is paramount to the recovery and balance of your hormones I'm going to go into it deeper later but just at the beginning now uh, diet is really essential and I want you to uh, put things over that pop up into your mind or I mention and they relate to you pop it over onto the get it done and check it off your list so diet is number one number two is your mind uh, getting your mind and your headspace really right is really essential whether that is meditation or walking or relationships but we'll get into that later so having the right uh, frame of mind is essential. Number three is nutrition. Uh, nutrition is different to diet. We wanna get our nutrition from our diet, but in this world, uh, it is heavy, heavily contaminated. Uh, a lot of people are deficient, uh, and you may be, because you've, you've obviously came about to come here struggling and wanna improve your hormones. And most likely there'll be some keys uh, that you need to improve. You can do it through diet, certainly. In my experience, uh, therapeutic dosages of specific nutrients will really help and speed it up. And I've got some places where you can get them from and really good high quality grade therapeutic nutrients as well. But I'll talk about those later. Focus area number four is lifestyle. Lifestyle involves all the things that uh, from your home, from your work, from the environment that are negatively impacting your health. Uh, they can be positively impacting your health as well, but generally things like pesticides, chemicals, uh, preservatives and, and things like this, and it can even be sick building syndrome. But there's a whole uh, area that I'll get into uh, further down the track. And they're the get it done for area four. Number five is herbs. So I'm going to mention throughout the 12 weeks herbs, and you may hear the name, or I may mention something specific which relates to your, your hormone disruptions, and then you can put it over onto your get it done list and source that herb or even source a formula or similar. Okay, so get it done number six is testing. Uh, testing, we can investigate a lot of different things and there's differences between general doctor testing. No matter where you are in the world, a doctor will do some investigations. Uh, however, what I'm recommending is something called functional pathology. It's the testing of the workings a little bit deeper and there are a lot of tests available and they go very deep. So I'll mention throughout the 12 weeks some tests that you can get done and whether they're saliva, stool, hair, blood, whatever the case, pop them over on the get it done list. And if you, if you wanna do all of them, do all of them. If you wanna do just some or some that are really key for you, at least you'll have the name of the test and exactly where to get it from as well. Uh, point number seven on the get it done list, it's the final part, is exercise. Exercise is paramount. It doesn't matter who you are or where you are now, what you're doing, whether you're exercising, you're walking, you're running, you're swimming, all of it is really important and I would encourage you to do a bit more, maybe, but we'll get into that later. So exercise, get it done, transfer it over onto the, the get it done page. So that's the summary for today. Um, you've got some things to do and get it done. And I'll see you tomorrow. Thank you.